YouTube, welcome to The Dam. My name is McCavity Cat. Welcome back to my channel, guys. And today we're in a different location, all right? Uh, we recorded Suspiracy Episode 2, the podcast my wife and I do last night. Uh, and this is kind of the set that we chose for that. Didn't really feel like moving the, uh, the lights and stuff around, if that makes sense. Uh, so we got some Funkos in the back. There's also some, like, boxes and garbage. We're still kind of moving in her, uh, her books for the, uh, the bookcase and stuff like that. Uh, but yeah, I figured why not just sit at the bar today, have a drink, maybe not, uh, and open some Funkos, right? Uh, yesterday we got a pop in the box, uh, mystery box, it was two pops, and I'll play that up on uh, on the screen right now, showing off the, uh, the pops that we got, the first one being the lovely Angry Angry Pikachu, and the second one uh, being Mowgli from Jungle Book. Mowgli came in at... Uh, $25 value, and Pikachu came in at $15 value, making it a $40 box that we paid after shipping $22 for, so it was a good box. Today, we have some mystery grails, and a lot of people, uh, a lot of people talk greasy about the mystery grails right here, you know? Uh, but I don't, I don't, I mean, I've been ordering them since they kind of popped up, and, uh, you know, maybe got one pop that was like six bucks, but the rest of them are pretty close to cost of the box. They're $19 a piece after shipping, $15 before, $4 shipping for both. Uh, and then I have this right here that showed up from uh, GameStop the other day that I'm going to open as well. Uh, and I know what this one is, but uh, y'all might not, I guess. So we'll start with that one to add to the Star Wars collection. Uh, we had to pick up Ben Solo. Uh, absolutely love Mr. Solo. Love Kylo Ren. Probably my favorite bad guy uh, in Star Wars. And we will talk about. Uh, we're going to talk about fandoms in uh, this week's this this coming weeks. Actually, by the time you're watching this, uh, it should be out already or coming out in a couple days. Next episode of Collecting Dust. Uh, the rant will be uh, kind of about fandoms and how kind of stupid we all are. I digress. Mystery Grail. A lot of videos out there talking about how Mystery Grail is just a scam. Uh, you never get uh, your value back, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, I would call it a lie. I'm too small of a channel to be sponsored. I'm not sponsored by Mystery Grail. I just think these are fun boxes. And like I said, there's only been one time where I haven't made up or, or just less made up the the value of the box uh one time we got a pot that was like six bucks it was a mad max figure it was super stupid um but that's kind of what you get especially if you can read and you read the website that says these are not guaranteed value boxes so i guess to me that never really bugged me because i can read and it says you know if something says no guaranteed value you might get a five dollar pop or you might get a five hundred dollar pop to me that's just common sense but I think we just hop into the Mystery Grail boxes and uh, test the luck, right? Maybe we get a Grail today. Probably not. But again, because I read the website, every time that I do these, I understand that uh, you're more likely than not going to hit a Grail. So I can't see it. What did we get? Anything good? I flip it back around here. Oh! Super Saiyan Vegito from the Dragon Ball Z. Interesting. Neat. So we'll pop him up here. Maybe it can focus. And of course, uh, you get a scratch and win little scratcher with uh, with every order. And candy, but uh, I'm not really big into candy. Uh, and here we go. We got a 10% off of a Zobi order. If you haven't heard of like shopzobi.com, you can go ahead and get uh, autographed Funko Pops over there. So that's kind of cool. We'll check value at the end. Super Saiyan Vegito. Uh, don't really, I mean, I have like Android 18. because She used to be like my favorite Dragon Ball character. Uh, and we have a couple others like Goten, but not something that we actively, actively collect. But it's kind of cool. So let's see here, in the second final box in today's video. Uh, 
What did we get here? Okay, we got War Machine from the Avengers. Another Shop Zobi 10% coupon uh, that I probably won't use. So if you saw the code, go ahead and use it. And of course, uh, another scratcher that we will scratch as well. So we will shut these. Um, I collect Marvel. I, act I actively collect Marvel Funko Pops. So this guy, uh, it's pretty exciting. Maybe we can uh, pop him up in there, get him to focus a little bit. So we got the War Machine from Avengers. Cool. So I just think we'll go through all these pops real quick, check value on the Funko app. Uh, a lot of uh, YouTubers I noticed use the WhatNot app. Uh, PPG should be the same, so I don't know what that's all about. Uh, ben Solo fo floating around a PPG value of $10. That's fine. Wasn't expecting him to be worth much. Uh, I just like him. War Machine. Oh, here we go. Now I'm going to bite my tongue. I got to add him to the collection. PPG value of $10. So we did go way under on that box and we might have gone way under on this box, but I, I didn't own either of these two. And like I said, they specifically mentioned uh, no guaranteed value on these boxes. And Super Saiyan Vegito is trending at $17. So without the shipping, uh, we were overvalue on that one. Oh, that one for the Funimation sticker, maybe. But with shipping, so we did lose in total $11 on these boxes, but now we have to scratch the scratchers because I don't know if a lot of people that, uh, that do these mystery boxes are counting the scratchers because you can actually get prizes and claim the points. So I'm going to scratch these and then I'll be right back. All right, we're back. And uh, this first one, I'm going to cover up the, uh, the coat, but we got a 200 token, so about two bucks. And on this one, we got a 500 token. So seven bucks total in, in about value for those. So 17 plus seven is what, 24 plus 10, $34. I spent about $34 total, if, you, if we think about it that way. Did I do that right? 17 plus seven, yeah, 24, obviously math, plus 10, 34. These were $15 a piece, so I spent 38. 38 and got $34 worth of value back, essentially. Uh, yeah, anyway, guys, that's the video. If you liked it, like it, comment down below. Tell me what you're collecting right now. Are you collecting Funkos? Have you ever opened these mystery grail mystery boxes? If you have, what are your thoughts on them? I'm gonna go uh, claim my tokens. I already had like 2,000, so. I'm gonna go get some pops that I wanted, maybe some sodas. I will catch you in the next one. Take care.